Hello, this is Joe from Cinematic Instruments. Today I like to walk through our newest instrument, the Vertigo Flute. Vertigo Flute is another addition to our Vertigo series. So it has similar sonic characteristics, namely the warm and gritty tones of the Vertigo instruments as you hear right now. We put a lot of effort into creating a diverse range of articulations, allowing the user to blend from subtle tones to more exper experimental soundscapes. The effect sections of the, our Vertigo engine enables you to tweak sounds to create anything from cozy warm pads to rougher sounds and textures. So, let's dive into it. First, I press the reset button to delete everything so we can better show the articulations. Okay, we have the following articulations. First of all, we have the regular division. These are just usual flow tones in three variations. We have A and B, which were truly two complete different persons. As you can hear. <laughs> B. And then you have six flute players uh, played simultaneously. Then you have the fragile division. A fragile is the articulation where you play very, very softly with two variations. It's just one person. Or four persons. Put a little, little reverb in it, that sounds a little bit nicer. Okay, then we have the tape division. This is a division where we, where we send the, the original flute tones through real tape devices. with four flute signals simultaneously. Then we have the avant-garde division, which um, consists of just a flute with moving sounds. It's three players moving. You can put it at the left, right? Okay, then you have flutter with four persons. And you have a distortion. Then uh, comes the resampled division, where we resample the original flute tones with various uh, hardware gear, such as here, here the Panamonium from Rossum Electronics, it's just a um, modular electronic. And we just send it through a, a bunch of modules. And finally, we have the, the blow division with just the airflow without any tone with one player or with three players. It's very funny because it's also pitched chromatically so you can play melodies just with the flute airflow. And now you can start just mixing and layering all the sounds. Maybe just I put in like this. If 
you activate the MW button, which stands for Mod Wheel, then you can play uh, the entire sound with the Mod Wheel. And you can just change the tone. Or you can just use this Rotary Vintage effect. Or just put some depth into it. And finally you have the reverb, where you can just put infinity reverb. So all in all, the vertical flute is a versatile and easy to use tool for sculpting textures fitting for film. But feeling equally at home among every producer looking for organic, breathy and uh, unique timbres. In the following minutes, I just will play uh, several of the, of the presets. We just put in the, the vertical flute and keep my mouth shut so we can easily and calmly listen to how vertical flute sounds. Okay, let's go. I start with the outer area, which was the preset at the beginning.
So that was a small rush through all presets. As you can see in the Vertigo engine you can set the volume and the panning for each articulation. And the intervals you can set here. Hence the complex presets. But Vertigo Flute has a new feature. You can, if you let the random generator set everything, see here, block the interval. You see here, here. you can lock it and so the result is often not so cha chaotic. So I just play this. But I better select this preset here. I can lock it here and now. And so the dice function is more a variation generator than a random generator that randomly sets the complete instrument. Okay, that's it for now. I hope you had fun listening to the Vertigo Flute and take care and keep healthy. See you soon. Bye.